So we just went and picked up Hudson. I've got both the kids with me and we are headed to church. It's hard as a rock. It's not good at all. Okay, so we are leaving church. Got the kiddos back there. And we're headed to... We're leaving church. And we're going to Party City to get balloons for their pictures today. Oh, I wish I could have videoed that. That was quite the experience. It's super windy outside. So first off, I'm nervous how these pictures are going to go because it's cold and windy. Lately, it's been like in the 60s and 70s. Today, it's in the 40s. Of course, the day we do pictures, it's cold and windy. But I got the kids back in their seats. Oh, no. I just lost a balloon. Um, got the balloons blown up. Just lost one. So naturally, even though the other day I... Um, ask y'all which outfit for our family Christmas pictures. I have been procrastinating about picking out her outfits and everything for the rest of it as like props and all of that kind of stuff because I'm a procrastinator like I, I can't do anything early and then I always get stressed out about it so I'm working on getting it together now. We've got about an hour and a half before pictures and so I was going to show y'all what I have for her pictures. So I have this little outfit, and um, this is the tutu I showed in a different video. I, I wish it was a little bit longer. It's, it's actually the one she wore in her, her, her six-month pictures. Um, but so hopefully it is long enough and it works. And then this is her little birthday shirt, which oh, I just love it. I think it's so cute because um, if you've seen the video, their party prep, which if you haven't, go look on that. But it's princess and a knight. That's the theme of their birthday party. So I got her this little shirt. And this one, she's actually going to wear on her birthday. I should be making a different shirt for her party if I have time and get it done. Um, but so this little shirt with this um, tutu. And then she has her crown, like a little um, headband crown. It's also in that the party prep video that she's going to be wearing with this. But... It's freezing outside, so I don't know if I'm going to, and these are the little shoes, which I ordered these, and they're a little big. She has the tiniest little feet, but um, they'll be fine for the pictures. Are these not the cutest thing ever? I love them. So, I'm trying to decide if I'm going to just kind of have her cold for a minute and have nothing on her legs, or I have... These are some little, like, pants that go with an outfit, and they've got some little ruffles at the bottom. I'm so mad. I have white and I have dark pink baby legs, but I only have one of each. I can't find the other for the matching pair, which is so frustrating because either of those would be perfect for it. But so I have this and I've got, I bought some at Hobby Lobby. Let me show you what I bought. And I don't know that they match good. I'm probably going to take these back, but I bought them just in case. Um, just some polka dots. And so they match the tutu better because that's a lighter pink that the name, I was hoping it would be darker because this is a darker pink, but hopefully in pictures and outside, it won't be that noticeable. So I'm going to see, I don't know. We might do the polka dot baby legs and those little shoes. My mom is going to be there and the photographer is a good friend of mine. So I'm probably going to ask what they think, but look at what I got at Hobby Lobby for, because our photographer has like just the white letters that she uses, but I saw these and I could not resist. Um, and there's the in in there, but they are pink glitter and they've got the little things so they look like they light up, but they don't actually. Um, I thought those would be so cute for her one year pictures. And I have a little, it's like a wooden crate that my mom is going to bring that she has at her house that I'm going to have for her to kind of like stand up on because she can stand up if she's holding on to something. So I'm going to have those for her to like lean on in the pictures. And then I have this banner that I actually made this for her baby shower and got her name on it. Excuse the clothes. That's, I picked out Chase's shirts. We got everything for our family pictures. But, and I sent a picture of this to my friend who's doing the pictures because I was, I'm a little worried that it's too busy and too many colors, but she said that she thinks it looks great. So that throws a little bit of teal in there because teal is in her nursery. Uh, it's not necessarily in the birthday party, but it does, her shirt does have teal. So hopefully it can all blend together. And then the balloons that I got, which would have popped but it's so frustrating, like I had just got in the car. But it was so windy and 
getting the kids back out of the car to go back. I was like, it's not even worth it. I'd rather not have balloons than have to go back in and deal with that hassle. But so I have all of that for her like birthday pictures. And then we've got our family pictures and I have, let me show you over here, excuse our huge pile of laundry. Um, these little pants that have the ruffles. And then this is a sweater dress. Um, and it's got, it's kind of hard to see cause it's gray with white, but they're very subtle little stars on there. Um, this is a baby gap that I got, of course, at a consignment sale. Uh, so I was thinking I'm, I'm taking this outfit in case we want another outfit to do more pictures. So we just got done doing pictures and McLean's back there. We had stopped at the store. Um, Chase wanted to run in and grab something. So he took Hudson with him and her and I are just sitting here waiting. Uh, pictures turned out pretty good. The guy, I know she showed me a couple that I know are going to be really cute. It is so cold and windy today though. So I, it, we had a hard time, especially with the balloons that I went through so much trouble to get because it was just so windy. We couldn't get them to like stand straight enough for a picture. They're all like all over the place, knocking stuff over. So hopefully the ones of her, um, like, you know, birthday ones turn out good, but we've got a lot of really cute ones for the Christmas. I have one, oh, I love it. She showed me on her camera. They're sitting back to back in front of a red barn with like their back, back to back, obviously means their backs are touching and they're both looking and smiling. It is the cutest picture and I'm so excited about it. So I'm just here where I tend to end the vlogs a lot, giving the kids a bath and we've had, um, a cold day taking pictures outside it was really cold and windy today and then we came home and i made some quesadillas for dinner and then we've just been hanging out playing as a family and now the kids are getting their bath and getting ready for bed so i just wanted to come on and tell you guys that i hope you enjoyed the vlog and i will definitely do a video and post some of the pictures when i get them um she it differs, you know, sometimes she'll give me the pictures back in a day, sometimes it's like a month. So, I don't know, I know she's really busy. She had a lot of people doing um, Christmas pictures, so hopefully sooner than later we'll get them, but I'll definitely show them to you when we do get them. But I hope you guys have a great night, and I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye. Bye! This is the pitiful face of the little girl who just pooped in the tub. You pooped in the tub, and Bubby was in there. Yucky! Yucky!